and welcome back to 100 baby we are here with gracie and we are at the home you guys we have so much that is going on can we go out here yet let's talk to the plant and research because we are going to be needing the plasma fruit tree for the vampires who it actually looks like are going to be aging up today <laughs> kind of nervous about that oh we should probably weed all of these it's a little bit of a mess so we do have quite a few things you guys that is going to be happening in today's episode so Jesse is kind of working on making up some food for everybody. Let's put that away. And you guys, I think we are going to be saying goodbye to Jesse for the next episode. Just because we are going to be needing more space for Gracie to continue having the babies. Okay, so we do have everybody heading off to school. Now, Casper and Ken, you guys, most likely are going to be coming home promoted because we did get their project done, we did their homework, and they have everything complete that they need to to become promoted, so we might actually be having some freaking vampires <laughs> in our house, and I'm actually not even ready for that. Okay, so 8 o'clock, everybody should be going to school, so let's get everybody on their way. Is he going to be going... Oh, he might not actually be able to go because he just aged up. So we did have Levi just age up. Jesse, he is just kind of staying home because he has a career now. Okay, so we're going to send the boys off. Now, the next thing that we are going to be doing, I don't know if I got the notification yet for the babies because it is actually their birthday today. So, okay, I don't see the notification yet. But today is our little newborn's birthday, so they're going to be able to age up. So I think what we are going to be doing today is having Gracie invite somebody over because we are going to be able to become pregnant again. So let's go over to um, invite. So I think we're actually going to invite a few people over today just so we can kind of get a little bit of a head start. Oh my gosh, I'm not really seeing... We can invite Andre over. A third. Ooh, let's invite Jacob over. Okay, so we'll invite those two. And, oh gosh, okay, here comes our mail. So, you guys, we have 44,000 simoleons. So, we are going to be able to do some major upgrades. And, okay, let's get the mail. After we've finished all of that. Ooh, who is this? <gasps> That's an interesting outfit. Wait a minute. Um, orange, Bailey Moon. Uh, let's ask for an autograph. Is he famous? Rising star. He looks so, so, um, angry. <laughs> he does not look too freaking help, happy to be here. Okay, we're not going to weed. Jesse starts work soon. Okay, Gracie, are you not going to be able to come over? Okay, so we're probably going to need to make another friend. What are we doing? What are we taking a picture of? Are we researching? Oh my gosh, you guys. He is so adorable. I really don't want to move Jesse out, but I kind of feel like we don't really have an option right now. So is everybody coming over? Okay, so we are going to be able to get Gracie kind of working on some new relationships because we are, like I said, going to be able to have her pregnant because we do have one space available. Who is this? Oh, wait. Okay, we just invited you over. Are you going in through the back door? Um, okay. <laughs> That's strange. Are you coming over? And, okay, so once Gracie does become pregnant and in the next episode, we are going to have Jesse move out. So we could possibly even have twins. And let's go in. Talk about the weather. Have we? Okay. Actually, some of you guys have been asking for me to go over the family tree. We're going to study hard for both of them. And, okay, so Gracie, let's just kind of take a little bit of a peek at the family tree. So, originally we did start with April who had her children right here. And we are moving into Gracie's family tree. So, we do have Ian. Now, let's start with Ian. Where... Oh my gosh, we have like so many kids, you guys. So we have Ivan. Where is, oh my gosh, here's our first generation up here. We have Carter, where's Aaron? Deceased by old age. Cody died by old age, old age. 
Okay, so they have all passed on by old age. Ooh, okay, so there's actually a little bit going on. So we do have Finn and Felicia, Ella, as well as Dream, who are still all alive. And Aaron doesn't look like he did get married, unfortunately. Oh, gosh. That's kind of sad. A lot of you guys were actually asking about that. Okay, well... We have quite a ways to go, you guys. <laughs> we're not quite halfway there yet, but we do have a lot of work to do. So I think we're going to get Gracie to come over. Try to cheer up. What are you? You are a young adult. Okay, so we are definitely going to need to get working on a friendship as well as a little bit of romance. With you, he looks so baby. Andre has like a baby face. Yeah, let's cheer him up a little bit. He's not looking so happy. But I mean... Where? Who are we talking to? Oh my gosh. Okay, so we were already talking to Jacob, who is also a young adult. Everybody looks so miserable. <laughs> Everybody came over and they're just like so not feeling it. And is there anybody outside? Here's the two projects. So we're still going to be able to sell that as well. Ooh, he's not. Let's enthuse about vampires just because we have learned so much about them. I'm going to flirt. I'm just going to see how he likes being flirted with. Let's see if he has a little bit of romance in. Uh, he's smiling. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. Okay, our phone's ringing. Hi, Levi. Just wanted to let you know that Dream has passed away. Oh my gosh, you guys. We just were looking at that. Okay, Gracie, we're going to flirt. He is scaring us. Let's just kind of keep on flirting with him a little bit. I know we're not really going to be able to woohoo with him yet, but we're going to get working on that. <laughs> he seems to like be really into it. Let's compliment his appearance. And we still haven't gotten the notification for the babies yet, even though today is actually their birthday. So hopefully around noontime we will be able to get that so we can age them up. Okay, romance blow a kiss. Oh, oh no, we have a baby crying. Oh, dirty diaper. Two dirty diapers. Oh gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> we really need to get that notification. We need to age them up. Okay, Gracie, you need to stop talking and come over. Oh god, she has no time for romance. Okay, you need to leave. Um, yes, you need to go somewhere. Uh, Flirt? Okay, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Just needed to get him to leave for a minute. And you guys might actually be hungry. Okay, so they're fine for now. We're going to continue going over here because that was actually going really well. Which one are you again, Andre? Oh, no, we have a crying baby. Feed. Okay, let's bottle feed both of you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Are they, like, fighting over Gracie right now? <laughs> what the heck is going on? Somebody is crying. We have Holly over here. She, like, lives here, but I don't know what is going on. Okay, so we do have Levi. He's probably actually, like, really upset because everybody has been, like, passing away. You can come over. We're going to get you to come over and just kind of, like, tell a story and get working on the communication a little bit. Okay, good. Holly. <laughs> Holly is actually helping. Sometimes she comes over and she doesn't really seem to help. Um, I'm pretty sure our baby needs to be fed. Gracie, come over. Feed our baby. And let's continue flirting. <laughs> and yeah, we still cannot woohoo. Okay, we're watching a little bit of Sims 3. Okay, so the boys are just kind of hanging out. It's a little bit awkward. And they're gaming. <laughs> Definitely a little bit awkward because Gracie's just like, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Okay, so let's go back over. I'm going to try to... Let's attempt a mistletoe kiss. Let's see if he's going to like that. Oh my gosh. He is... Yes! Oh my god. And he's just like, all right, I can't watch this. <laughs> Okay, well, that went really well. Let's blow him a kiss. He seems to be actually, like, really into it. 
very romantic and let's keep on flirting a little bit reach level four charisma oh god okay pick up line i don't think we can nope not yet we need to have that first kiss oh my gosh we are there already <laughs> I feel like the longer we play, like, Gracie is just getting so good at winning hearts over. So we had our first kiss. And are we able to possibly try for a baby? Let's kiss his hands. Oh, my gosh. Gracie is just, like, <laughs> embrace, offer rose, tickle. Let's snuggle just a little bit. And... I don't know how much longer we're going to have to wait until we can do a little bit of woohooing. Let's do a little bit of a sexy pose. And Gracie, I don't know what you just changed into. <laughs> no, you don't. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You cannot leave. Let's offer you a rose. It's going way too good for him to actually like leave our home. Blow a kiss. No, he's going to disappear, <laughs> and it's going to be just like it never happened. Oh, my gosh. I should really get going. Okay, everybody is leaving. Come over. Kiss. Yes. Oh, my gosh. He stopped. Is he playing hard to get? Give him a rose. He loves it. Okay. <laughs> I think we have finally won him back over, and let's go in. We're going to actually do... A little bit of woohoo and we're gonna actually eventually be trying for this baby um goodbye Ooh, it's getting steamy you guys <laughs> it's going really well let's see if we can no we do not want him to be let's try for a baby Ooh, which one are they gonna do first woohoo yes let's try for a baby now that we have that um, romance, more choices, try for a baby. <gasps> no, <laughs> it was going so well. They were going to woohoo and I thought it would cancel it to try to speed it up and it didn't work out so well. So let's see if we can actually invite over Andre again. Let's see if he will come back over. The babies are sleeping. Everything is going well. We have so much money. Okay, invite to hang over. Andre will be right over. Okay, here he is. Let's try this again. Oh my gosh, you guys. Hope he is actually like still in the mood. Let's try for a baby. It didn't click on. Oh my gosh. It is almost Gracie's birthday. Oh no. Um try for a baby. Okay. <gasps> <laughs> so Gracie is feeling really flirty and so is Andre. So you guys, I definitely feel like they are going to be able to try for a baby. I'm actually really hopeful. He's like, okay. <laughs> yes, okay. <laughs> and Ken is an A student. We also have Casper as an A student. And do we have a cake in here? Um, Let's open this up. We do have a cake with the birthday candles and reach level two. Oh my gosh, you guys, I actually cannot believe how much has been happening already. I feel like, like we just started the episode and I can hear the music. Okay, so Gracie is getting it on. She is trying to become pregnant and we are gonna be having Casper and Ken blow out the candle. So we are gonna be starting with Casper. Okay, you guys, well, Casper is going to be aging up, and I'm actually freaking terrified about this because we are finally going to be having vampires in our home. So we're going to be choosing a random trait or aspiration for Casper, and this one is actually going to be a little bit interesting because there are, he's a vampire, so it's going to kind of be a little bit interesting for him. So Casper is going to be outdoor in Enthusiasts, outdoor enthusiasts want to experience everything nature has to offer, which is going to be really strange because Casper, when you're a vampire, you can't go outside in the daytime. <laughs> so it's kind of a little bit strange. And let's choose a random trait for Casper. Um, let's just kind of go through. And Casper is going to be a loner. Oh my God. What the heck? Oh, they're bows. 
<laughs> I thought those were his ears. I was going to say, what the world? But he's actually kind of cute. Okay, so we are definitely going to be needing to do a little bit of a makeover. And I'm terrified because we now have vampires in the house. And we are now going to be needing do not take a piece of cake. Add birthday candles. And I hear a baby. Now that Casper is a teen, his vampire powers have fully manifested. He is no longer has hunger, energy, and his bladder motive must consume plasma to satisfy his thirst. Okay, first thing we are going to have Gracie do is deal with, find out what's wrong. Let's do a super efficient baby care, and then we are going to have Gracie come over and take her pregnancy test. Okay, so... Oh my gosh, it's going to be time for the babies to age up. Gracie comes over. Okay, so Gracie is expecting our next baby, you guys. <laughs> so we have that going on. We have vampires and we do have Jessie that is going to be aging up. Okay, wait, you need to move out of the way. You need to come over and blow out the candles. Let's make sure we have Ken. Come over, blow out the candles and Gracie... You go here, come over, and we are going to do super efficient baby care. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we do not have our plasma fruit trees. Oh my gosh, look how big they are. Um, Talk to plant, fertilize. Okay, so we're going to need... Okay, so Ken has aged up, so we are going to be choosing a random trait for Ken. And he is going to be friend of the animals. And then we are going to be choosing a random trait for him. Which is going to be... Ooh, clumsy. Okay, that one's not too bad. <laughs> okay, so we're going to need to have... Talk to plant. Talk to plant. So we really do need to get working on this one here as well. Unfortunately, we're not able to evolve anything yet. So we have... Ken has sent a bunch of stuff in the mail... Now that Ken is a teen, his vampire, okay. Now we are going to need to, let's just order some plasma packs for now. Uh, medicine, seeds. I think we're gonna have to actually go over vampire secret, search for information. Okay, we're gonna need Gracie to come over. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. Oh my gosh, he looks so much like a TV vampire, and he's so angry looking. Oh my god, he has fangs, I'm scared. <laughs> this is going to be so miserable to have the teens in here. So what do we have for them to do? So we have homework. I hear a crying baby. Let's get you guys to work on homework. Oh my god, they're hissing. And everybody, let's go in. We're going to need to bottle feed. So we still have not received the notification, but today is actually the baby's birthday. So I might just go ahead and have them age up. I might have even missed the notification just because we have so many going on. However, we did get the notification for Gracie. So I'm not really sure what's going on. We have a crying baby. Uh, You're going to need... To possibly be fed. Okay, everybody is leaving. Okay, so one thing that we are going to be needing is... Oh, here we go. It is Molly's birthday and Mason's birthday. So we can actually now age them up. So we're not going to need to worry about crying babies anymore. We're going to go over and age them up. Oh, wow. <laughs> we are going to have four birthdays going on today. Gracie is pregnant and we have vampires. Ella has sent Molly a gift. Oh my gosh, we're going to have so much stuff in the mail. <laughs> and we're going to be choosing a random trait for Molly Angel. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh wow, she looks so much like Dream did. Wow, oh my gosh, she has like the same outfit and hair. She just has brown hair instead of black. Oh my gosh, it's like a little dream. And then we're going to come over and we're going to be aging up. Mason, so excited. Oh, wow. <laughs> Our baby split into two. And we have a random trait for Mason, who is a charmer. And has glasses, curly hair. Okay, that's actually really freaking adorable. 
Okay, Gracie, you need to come over and use before you pee your pants. Our house is extremely busy. <laughs> this is freaking insane. Okay, so you can now leave. Let's ask you to leave because we are going to be needing to use that computer. Okay, Gracie, you need to come get some food. We have had so much going on. So let's go over, eat some mac and cheese. Let's put the cake away. And you're going to be leaving. And then we are going to need to have Gracie come over and actually purchase plasma packs. We're going to we're going to get 6 <laughs> because I'm like terrified. Okay, so plasma packs can be found in her inventory. All right, so here is a plasma pack. Can we put them in the fridge? All right, so, oh my gosh. You guys are definitely going to need to help me with vampires because I am completely new to vampires. This is, okay, so we have to go that far before we can get our next power point. And these are going to be all of our powers and weaknesses. So much going on. Energy, thirst. Okay, so we really don't need a plasma packer. Thirst is good. But we are going to need to actually get some coffins. <laughs> this is insane, you guys. So I think it was about 80% of you guys actually voted to turn the clubhouse into a place for vampires for now. So we definitely will be able to switch this around. So we will be able to switch this whenever we need to. If, you know, the vampires move out, we can definitely change this up into a clubhouse. So we are going to be upgrading. We do have quite a bit of money, you guys. So I think we're going to get them like a really nice coffin. Energy 10. Let's just get them. Oh my gosh. Wait, is this not going to fit in? I think it could fit in. Let's put on our... Oh gosh. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, so we have our... Okay, so we have our move objects on. So we're going to put one of the coffins right here. And let's just put in another one. Can we put that there? And hopefully we will be able to get to it. Let's just maybe put it like that. And it is so creepy out here. Do we have any wallpaper? Let's do... Oh, I don't like the bats. <laughs> They're a little bit strange. So we definitely are going to be needing to do a little bit of like renovations out here and add in just like a little bit more of vampire stuff. But this should be fine. I want to make sure the vampires can actually go out and we can claim this one for you. And we're going to send Ken out to claim and you can sleep. Yeah, we're not going to hibernate. <laughs> we're going to go out. We are going to sleep and claim that for you. And we now have vampires. I'm shaking. You guys can't see me, but I definitely am shaking <laughs> a little bit. So I think that is where we are going to be ending today's episode of 100 Baby, you guys. It was definitely a busy one. So much going on. So many toddlers. But we are going to be moving Jesse out in the next episode. So we will be able to have Gracie get working on our next pregnancy um, when she has this baby if we don't have twins and continue on learning more about those creepy freaking vampires. <laughs> so make sure that you guys flood out those comments with your baby name suggestions. Make sure to give this video a very big thumbs up and hopefully I'm going to see you all next time. Bye guys. Thank you.